But I don't even care, actually. I don't care about getting into heaven because heaven doesn't sound that much greater than hell in comparison. I don't want to go to hell, but I don't feel like they've gone into enough detail about how awesome heaven will be in comparison to the volumes of detail of how terrible hell will be. Like, I would like you to give me more information. Give me, I want specific information on the prizes that I win when I get to heaven. <laughs> I want to know. There's an endless fountain of gin and Oxycontin in the center of town. And you no longer have addiction issues, so drink up, buddy. I want to know. There's a free Cadillac Escalade for everyone in heaven, and you don't look weird driving them if you're white. I want to know. But all they do is tell you about the negative parts of hell. Like if you've read Dante's Inferno, which I have because I'm smarter than all of you, um, <laughs> you will know that there are very intricate descriptions of what hell is like. Like the, the first, there's layers. So like the first layer is a, a river of boiling shit that you swim in for a thousand years. And the second layer, you eat rust for a thousand years. And the third layer, you sh shit the rust out into a riverbed. It's very painful. I'm like, I'm totally convinced. I don't want to go. What do I get if I'm good? What do I get in heaven? They're like, a harp. <laughs> a harp? Can you imagine? Can you imagine what it would be like if you sacrifice the important things you need to sacrifice in life in order to get to heaven, like marijuana and anonymous blowjobs, and you get up there? <laughs> and it's exactly how they envisioned it for you in the cartoons. Like, hey, welcome to heaven. Here's your harp. <laughs> Oh, this was real. Okay. Yeah, I always imagine this was some sort of metaphor. No? Okay. You're gonna give it a good college try because you got into heaven after all. You're a good person. You go, I guess I'll hang in there, see what happens. <laughs> 5,000 years goes by. I'm still plucking! Is this it? Is this all there is to heaven? No, there's one more treat. You get to hang out with your family forever. <laughs> oh, that sounds great. You remember the last time you spent the afternoon with your mom? Yeah, you remember that moment when you're like, I gotta get out of here now! <laughs> That's when forever begins. <laughs> with your mom on the cloud next to you, looking over at you, complaining about your harp playing skills. How you don't play the harp that great anyway. How your brother used to get straight A's when he played the harp. Nobody wants to see you on stage telling jokes! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, everybody. I think I did a bit of psychological overlap on that last joke. 